Hello friends, it's Courtney, Lightning Cruz. There's a lot of fear happening right now. And I just wanted to let you know that you don't have to entertain it just because it's happening around you and people are freaking out. You don't have to think about it and talk about it. Just leave your phone inside and go outside and sit under a tree for a while. Or go outside at night and look at the stars. You might, you can take your phone, but you can't look at it. Something creepy happened last night, and if I hadn't had my phone, <laughs> I would have been stuck out there forever. But my point is... I'm living in a world that is just away from everything I don't want to hear about. If people want to talk about stuff around me that I don't want to hear, I either leave the room or I say, oh my gosh, you guys, you've got to stop talking about it. Because thoughts are energy. It's alive. The more you think about it, the more you focus on it, the more it grows and takes on a life of its own. That's how thoughts work. So if everybody's freaking out about something, you're just breathing life into that idea. And then it's becoming real. Because that's how thoughts work. So if you don't think about it, you don't focus on it, you don't entertain the idea, you don't give it any more power to get any stronger, you just go outside, be in nature for a while. And people are, people may say something like, well, I'm just one person. I'm not doing anything. But you are, man. Because if you give your energy, your focus, on something... <sighs> That's Thunder. He's fine. He's just being a... <sighs> if you focus on it... Then it becomes real and if you let it go then it just floats on as thoughts do i'm just one person what am i doing that's where we were hang on Because your energy is contributing to the thought. You're focused on it. You're helping. You're not helping. You're contributing to whatever the thought is. If you don't think about it, you're not contributing. If more people didn't contribute their focus, then it wouldn't be an issue. Oh, yeah. I got back to my thought process. Woo! Wouldn't you rather focus on this? Oh. 
I've watched so many caterpillars lives today. They're just everywhere, all of a sudden, caterpillars. And the bees have come back. And there's the lizards and butterflies. Spider webs everywhere that I keep walking into. I'm so tall. I walk into all the spider webs. <laughs> there are currently three differences in the yard. You can definitely see two of them. I don't know about the third. Let me know if you know what they are. Also, so if you just breathe in and know that everything's going to be okay and breathe out, there's nothing to fear because why would there be? If you focus on the fear, the fear is going to grow. If you focus on anything else, the fear is going to go away. You have to believe in it for it to affect you. You don't have to believe in it at all. If you focus on hopelessness, hopelessness grows. If you focus on anger, anger grows. If you focus on love, love grows. If you focus on what makes you happy, you're going to find something else that makes you even happier. And go do that. Because that feeling is worth chasing. You have the power. You can change it. You can change your life. And then other people see that you are awesome and they want to be awesome too. And so you're affecting them. Like ripples. Everything connects. So how about instead of focusing on fear, you do something that makes you happy. If you don't know what makes you happy, go sit outside. In all kinds of weather, in all kinds of lighting. I like natural lighting versus electric lighting myself. The varying degrees of nighttime. Listen to the birds, listen to the wind. What do you smell? Focus on those things. See what happens. Do it every day. Do it whenever you are afraid. Go outside and just be there. You're okay. It's gonna be okay. I... I know. I'm here, you're not alone, you're never alone, even if I'm not there. Everyone has a whole team of beings. It's up to you to connect with them. And let go of your expectation of what you think they should look like. Because usually what I see is, like, lights. Different colored lights is what I see a lot.
Do what makes you happy. Unapologetically. People may look at you like you're a weirdo. It's okay. You might be a weirdo. Also, okay. But if you have to live your life based on how people are looking at you, you're never going to have any fun. Here's an illusion. Your your thoughts are the reality. Who are you gonna be? Happy hunting on your journey, discovering who you are. I love you guys. Bye!